loves improv and storytelling, Eileen Burke Woodward. By the way, don't you think DNA actually looks like a mountain man? Yeah, I think so. Um, and speaking of mountains, uh, you know, Mount Everest being uh, part of the topic tonight, um, I've never been there or, you know, if I haven't been there, obviously I haven't climbed it. And I love mountains. I love to look at mountains. Um, I mean, I like to hike, uh, like at sea level. Mostly flat, asphalt, preferred. But um, I have actually um, been, I've been up high enough altitude-wise and had altitude sickness because I drove there. Uh, and this was up in Tahoe. <laughs> and we were at like 7,700 feet. And I was eight months pregnant and I didn't know that it, doctors don't really advise that you go, you know, straight up from sea level to that level, like when you're pregnant, like at all. That's why they, you don't, they don't want you really to fly either. So I did have altitude sickness. Um, my baby was totally fine, and I just suffered minor brain damage. But that's why I'm here tonight. I do like mountains. I, I actually do, even though I live by a beach. But we did. We did a little study on mountains, I mean, my oldest was four and two and then a baby. So I wouldn't really call it studying. It was like looking at pictures and videos. Shortly after the little mountain study that we had, we went on a family road trip. And um, I don't know if you've ever been on a road trip, but as you go along, bladders fill up. And at a point you have to stop and empty bladders. And so that happened. Not, we weren't surprised. And so then when he finishes, you know, he, we're in the stall, and he sort of steps to the side, and, and it's my turn. It was just number one. Not now, then. And, you know, I'm just about finished, and I look at him, and his eyes are huge, and I track. Like, what is he looking at? It's like thinking there's, like, a big spider back there or, you know, like something gross. And then I realize he's looking at my backside. And I'm about to ask him, you know, you know, what's the deal? Mom, your butt is so big. <laughs> Honey, can you use your inside voice? <laughs> and outside the stall, you hear the snickering and stifled laughter of the other women and moms out there. And I realized he didn't hear me ask him to use his inside voice. He heard them out there laughing. And he was going for an encore. <laughs> so I start to move as quickly as I can, but everything goes into slow motion as I try to get to that toilet handle before anything comes out of his mouth. But I'm too late. It's big and white like Mount Everest. <laughs> actually, I'm a country girl. I don't uh, actually live in Santa Cruz. I live south of it in a rural area. Um, you know, we have animal, you know, like big farm animals in the area. And uh, so for me, coming up here to San Francisco is a little bit, it's like my Mount Everest. You know, because I don't know much about the city. And uh, we, we were over, my husband's here tonight, and we were over in Union Square and just thought, oh, it's, it's not too long of a walk. And it wasn't. But, you know, we came through the Tenderloin. And I'm pretty sure we saw some Yetis. <laughs> Thank you. Keep it going for Eileen. <laughs> 